Right, hi everybody. I'm here with Chris Smith from Okta and we're going to be talking about recruiter enablement. Chris, give us a quick introduction. Who are you? What's your background and what's Okta? Oh, that's a question. Um, I'm Chris, the CEO of Okta. Uh, we soon to rebrand to nudge, N-U-D-J dot com, which kind of brings to life more of what we're all about. My background, Christ, I was thinking about this. I've been in and around the recruitment space for 30 years now. I know it's incredibly hard to believe because I've got such a pretty baby face. Um, started off in the IT staffing market, working for a company called Escom. Uh, after I fell out of college, really, um, and this was in the days when, you know, what was recruitment, you didn't know, you just took the job because you needed one. And um, I took to it like a duck to water. Um, over the following seven years, I stayed with one company um, called Escom. It was in the telco market, and we worked predominantly on rollout, network rollouts, yada, yada, yada. Uh, please say I did very well for myself. So in uh, 2000, I set up my own agency, myself and a good buddy of mine. Um, and we built that up to 12 million uh, in revenue. It's per manned uh, contract. The intention was to flip it after five years, but we took seven in the end. Uh, we exited to an aim listed company two weeks into the credit crunch, which was rather nice. Um, I then had this brilliant idea of um, pursuing digital uh, solutions, which seemed like a good idea at the time. Um, some were good, some were bad. One was a business called uh, My John Matcher. Now, My John Matcher was an incremental improvement on Indeed insofar as we matched you to jobs, aggregated together all the jobs like Indeed do, but you could only see what you could do. You had to upload your CV. Subsequently, we went on and we acquired job.com, but we were raising tons of money at the time. Um, it was a buy either land, find you or later kind of business, but... Um, between the three of us, the three founders, we uh, danced the dance and kept it going through some crazy times. I took someone on to be my own CEO with the intention of going out to the States. My father-in-law then sadly passed away and uh, myself and the family decided we couldn't be away from sunny, sunny UK. Um, so I sat down with the lads I started the business with and I took a bullet for the team because, like I said, I just took someone on to be my own CEO. Um, I'm pleased to say I've still got a bunch of stock in uh, job.com. It now turns over in the order of blah. they are quite aggressive in their acquisition strategy. It's turning over now. I would be guessing here, I'm not 100% sure, uh, in the order of 200 million. Um, it's got a pattern portfolio that is valued uh, recently at about 400 million um, they are in an incredibly good position I would estimate if they close some of the acquisitions that they are looking at they'll be turning over the best part of 500 600 million pretty damn soon um, I have to take my hat off to both Aaron and Paul who are still there um, because they had to go through some real SH1T um, to get it to where it is. After leaving job, old Smith here found out he got a bone tumour, which was a little bit scary. Um, nearly lost me bloody leg, which was fun, um, but I've still got it, and I'm still boxing, So, and I'm still pretty, so it still works. Um, anyway, uh, after learning to walk again, um, I was lying in bed, whacked out on Tramadol one day and thought, I've got an idea. Um, and that was a business called One Call to All, which is long for Okta, O-C-T-A, use Okta.com. And what do we do? We automate mass candidates and workforce outreach and communication uh, through simple voice, video, text automations with the singular purpose 
of allowing you to grow your business and enabling you to dominate your market. We democratise the whole of the recruitment space in many ways that a small company uh, can now have the same sort of firepower in terms of outreach as a, you know, a Hayes or a, or a Randstad or a Reed. Um, you could make a couple of thousand calls a day using your voice, connecting to people instantly about jobs that they want to do. And of course, like I say, it's all backed up as well with video and text. So many people think of us as the male chimp of everything else. And um, we are at the moment looking at doing a raise to scale. We've got, um, you know, I'm not daft. I've followed the uh, job.com blueprint. We've got five patents submitted. Um, we expect to have our first patent granted when probably in the next sort of eight to 12 weeks. So it's game on. Uh, we did some market discovery across other verticals and the platform works just as well in hospitality, in fan engagement for sports clubs, um, automotive, you know, we'll come and get your service and all that jazz. Um, there's about a 90% open rate on what we do because you just nudge them. Yep. See what we do. Yep. Okay. Yep. Um, you know, you want to get hold of someone, send a nudge. And, and that's what we're all about. That's terrific. I mean, what an amazing story you have. There's so many different elements to that. This channel's about enabling recruiters. And a lot of that yeah. is to do with like, um, how, how do we save them time? How do we, how do we help them do more faster? And you ha you've, you've touched on that, but let's delve into it a little bit more detail. When mm -hmm. you're pitching um, soon to be nudge, yeah. What are the, and somebody says to you, okay, what are the ways that I can, I can save time and be more productive with your product? What are the three or four main things that you would point them to? Well, there's, there's, look, we deliver massive operational savings, probably in the order of 80%. Um, the ROI on what we do is more or less instant. Sorry, someone's about to jump in here. Um, the ROI on what we do is pretty much more or less instant anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and like I say, let's just put it into this context that say you had an opportunity for, you know, I don't know, some call center operatives, you needed to find 10 of them tomorrow morning. Yeah. Um, it's Friday afternoon. You'd rather be on the golf course all weekend. You can identify there's 200 people who I need to contact. Yeah. You can tap a key and no bullshit it's done and your phone will light up instantly with people who want to talk about that job yeah terrific it doesn't we take are very soon as well gonna take it one step further that we will also provide you with additional candidates on top of your own so say for example you're looking for call center operatives um We'll be able to show you the call center operatives that are in the market there and then. Simple as that. Lots of exciting things coming as well. It doesn't it's take a lot. I don't tell anyone, right? Everyone out there, keep it still. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, it doesn't take a lot of imagination to work out. Um, if I can press a button and get 200 messages out that are like my voice to those individuals, and yeah. auto automation built baked in there that gets them scheduled yeah. in. And of course, don't forget you can do a video, you can show them around the workplace, you can ask them to upload right to work. A lot of people actually use the um, platform, you know, I always talk about HelloFresh and Deliveroo. They use the platform a lot of the time to speak to the existing workforce to yeah. say, you know, the CEO um, reaches out and says, hey, guys, thanks for a great week's work. Rah, rah, rah. Yeah. And include a video. Now, if you want to see a video, you see how uh, banging his gums, good for you. But um, it, it, it works. It creates that engagement. And a lot of people as well, let's not lose sight of the fact the market's about to turn. And um, it's going to be, you know, it's always feast or family recruitment. And you're going to have thousands of people applying for jobs and everyone's going to be screaming on every ear back and every ear back, boo hoo hoo, as they always do. With our platform, you could even monetize your recruitment for your clients. Say you were recruiting for Next. Um, look, speak to Next, get some voucher codes off them. 
And um, hey, presto, bosh, hello, it's Chris. Unfortunately, you never got the job on this occasion. Here's a link to some, some more jobs you can apply for. And as a thank you for applying to Next, there's a £5 voucher. Yep. But, um, now, that costs yep. Next nothing. That costs a low fresh nothing. That costs Deliveroo nothing. Yep. Yada, 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 yada. And it monetizes that recruitment. It also protects the brand. Take that on a level. Imagine you apply to, I don't know, Virgin. And rather than getting some shitty phone call off someone who doesn't really care or not even hearing back, you had a call in your voicemail or a little video from Richard Branson himself saying, I want to say thank you very much for applying. You'd be like a dog with two, wouldn't you? Yeah. Um, simple as that. So that's that's what we're all about. Um, I'll go back to my uh, one of my big things has always been the democratisation and the enabling even small companies to have the same level of firepower. Um, but, you know, say you're a specialist in one vertical and your client goes, oh, I don't suppose you've got any, you know, something that sits outside of your vertical. If your call centre bogs and they ask for a, don't know, a care home person or whatever, you don't have to drop the ball on your core focus. You can very quickly trawl the market, get some contact details and try it. You lose yeah. nothing. So yeah. is this oh. for um is this specifically for agency teams or is it for in-house uh, HR both. talent acquisition teams both, as well? Both. Yeah. I make no bones about that. We um it's a funny one as always. Um you know we I will say of course there's a free plan and it's an always free plan on our platform it's credit based so you know if you make a call, it's a credit. If you send a text, it's a credit. Yada, yada, yada. But we have a free plan for, for people. And obviously, you know, let's call it how it is. That free plan's there for a reason. Yeah, so people try it out. And if they yeah. like it, they can keep going. If they just want to use the free plan, just use it in free plan. It's all it's all good for me. Yeah. Um, you know, every user adds value to our business, whether they're paid for it or not. We don't we don't you know, mug off anyone's data or anything like that. We've got the same level of security as Barclay Bank. Um, you know, we're fully GDPR compliant, yada, yada, yada. Um, are we for agencies? Yes. Are we for big agencies? Yes. Are we for little agencies? Yes. Um, do we have direct hiring teams using us? Of course we do. Um, one of the companies we work for that does direct hiring actually was provisioning um, in-home carers. Part of that involved getting these people fully trained before going into the home to deliver the care on a particular piece of kit. Recruiters were sending people forward for these training days that were costing in the order of 1250 pound a week because they had to book them in for a week's training yada 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 that's in 10 five and finish and they said we've got a problem chopsy chopsy so we got together with the company that did the training we got together with the recruiter we triaged a, a solution between the three of us and now somebody who applies for those jobs receives a call and a text that says right click this link and your test starts now. They open up the link and it's the time test. So ask them about the course of medication. It randomizes the weights of patients and there are only certain answers you can give. And if you get to the end, it cuts all the BS out of people saying, yes, I can, yes, I can to the recruiter. And with absolute respect to the recruiters, they are doctors and bloody nurses and they don't know the medication plans and all of this. They do their best. And what happened subsequently since they implemented what we do, they only send five people a week rather than 10, but they've got a 100% pass rate. So they're happy bunnies, you know. Um, they're using our platform for top and take me and they're saving in the best part probably of about five, seven and a half, ten grand a week. Jobs are good. There's lots of really useful, um, uh, interesting use cases um, for this product. It's great. Um, part of what we do on this channel is to promote what in-house teams are doing, what agency teams are doing, as well as 
to give people inspiration through bringing people like you that are providing great solutions as well to enable recruiters yeah. better. So, Chris, I want to thank you very much for taking the time to come and join You're me more today. Welcome. It's been really interesting it's to hear your story and to hear about Okta, soon to be Nudge. And uh, interesting, in my story aren't said in the same sentence very often. So, I will thank you very much for that, Adam. Great. All the best. Take it easy, brother. <laughs>